parting of the waters. The Atlantic Ocean, 3,488 miles. And the Pacific Ocean, in 1,353 miles. Good morning. I woke up today to find that someone during the night had eaten my breakfast. It was me. <laughs> day 50 and I'm sleep eating. And I pondered this as I sat there in my sleeping bag eating crumbs off of my tent floor because A, I mean, I was hungry. And crumbs are super bear safe, of course. So, another stage in the hiker hunger. Do you think that's where we're going? I think it's where we're going. Think we're gonna go there? I mean, I don't know, like, cause over there is really flat, so I don't think it's gonna send us there. Probably there. not there. Seems likely. I've, I've often tried to explain to you all the concept of hiker trash, and here we have it perfectly embodied in ho horse hater, right? Yep. Okay. And big slice. So we've got some, some gear drying. We've got all the critical components, right? We've got the view. We've got some fresh water. And what do we got going on? What's for, what's for dinner? Mashed potatoes. Mm -hmm. And cheese its. <laughs> the cheese its are in there? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> That's amazing. You guys are doing it right. Well, I, for one, have no idea why they would call that Temple Lake. No idea at all. <laughs> okay, so there are approximately one million of these little friends. Neat. Come on. Holy cow. So I will be filtering. Good evening. Let's talk about cold soaking. Cold soaking is something that I don't understand, which obviously makes me a great person to talk about it. Nemo packed my resupply and she's one of my heroes. Like, if I get to grow up to be someone in 10 years, she is it. And she made Nemo's original cold soak Buddha bowl. Mmm. There's black beans. Mmm. She did some fun stuff with spices. Look at all that rice float and all that not rice, not. Okay, it's I hope it's not leaking. I need it to not leak. Well, that firmed up nicely. It smells amazing. Great, I'm gonna eat this. 